June 22nd. More than mere kindness. When was the last time you went to the dentist? Yikes, that's a scary thought, right? Well, what if I told you I found the perfect dentist? He never makes me do anything I don't want to do, and when I tell him what's bothering me, he always nods understandingly and encourages me that it'll work itself out. <laughs> well, if I was actually going to a dentist like this, what would you say? That I need to find a real doctor? I hope so. This dentist may be a good listening ear, but he's not giving me any real solutions. Today, we'll hear from a woman who spent the first difficult years of her life in an orphanage, and she definitely needed a caring friend in her life. But she also needed more than that. She's here to share with us her true story on this Unshackled Daily Devotional. I'm Debbie Stilley, and the taunts I received at school because of my tattered clothes would haunt me for years. Happiness came with my adoption by a couple who gave me a good home for three years. When they began fighting and divorced, I was heartbroken. I lived with my adoptive mother for a while and endured her boyfriend's touching. Then Dad took me in, and I went into depression. I was raped at 16, which left me wild and crazy. I played with astrology and seances, moved out on my own, and met Alan, who loved me. We married, and he put up with my temper tantrums and moody ways. Even when I hit him in a rage, he would just hold me tight. One day, Dad gave me a Bible and invited us to hear an evangelist. Both my husband and I raised our hands to receive Christ that night. We went home and prayed together, repeating the prayer of salvation. The next morning, I, I didn't feel any difference, so I memorized the scripture verse on the pamphlet they gave us. Wherewithal shall a young man cleanse his way? By taking heed thereto according to thy word. God changed me so much, I wrote a poem about my salvation and bought time on the Christian radio station to tell others about my transformed life. The Apostle Paul writes in 1 Thessalonians chapter 2, verses 11 and 12, As ye know how we exhorted and comforted and charged every one of you, as a father doth his children, that ye would walk worthy of God, who hath called you unto his kingdom and glory. Friend, Paul's love for the Thessalonian church urged him to exhort and charge them with the truth. While he had compassion, he also knew they needed more. In the same way, Alan's companionship alone could not heal Debbie of the anguish she had been through. It was only when they both were confronted with the gospel that they could receive the hope Jesus has offered through the cross. So as you love others, be sure your love goes beyond mere kindness and shares the truth with them that they're so desperately seeking. Will you receive this truth today? Unshackled Daily Devotionals are built on true life accounts and help us ponder the application of Scripture to our lives. Each devotional tells a dramatic testimony of transformation of a real person while addressing a relatable issue of the human condition. A key Bible verse is provided so you can dig deeper into its specific intent and what it means for our lives in these unshackled daily devotionals. Listen to a new devotional every day. And don't forget to tell your friends about Unshackled Daily Devotionals.